let me have the pleasure of uh, making the announcement for the semi finalist coach order of merit and invite mr s satyanarayana managing director okay. of okay. andhra pradesh okay. state okay. skill development corporation for skill development okay. ms benita mary jacker deputy commissioner of police from delhi police for project yuva congratulations ma'am thank you sir would you like to say a few words um yes sir the experience of uh, participating in such a uh, event has been a very very learning good learning experience because uh, got i wish this was happening in person because you know we were all connecting to video conference uh, we met many of our colleagues senior peers over many of these innovative schemes they have brought about in their own states this has given us ideas to incorporate and uh, no in in our states too so not just our own initiative but we've learned a lot from the initiatives that my colleague spread thank you everyone for this opportunity and uh, it's been great working with all of you congratulations once again these are really encouraging words thank you and now i invite mr harsha vardhan mandava additional deputy commissioner of police again from delhi police project e chitta mr brijendra kumar yadav deputy commissioner of police from delhi police for project hawkai good afternoon sir good afternoon mr yadav congratulations to you thanks a lot would you like to say a few words well, sir first of all thanks a lot uh, there are two aspects of uh, being uh, associated with the scotch the first one was as my batchmate vanita just mentioned that we shared the knowledge because knowledge increases once we share it so we also could see learn feel experience as to what other professionals have been doing in their own fields the best practices great projects the second aspect was uh, the encouragement not just to me as a person who just uh, led with the project but also the people who working on the ground jo hum kaam kar rahe the aur jab iska process chalu tha i was sharing this thing that you know we've been nominated for the scotch award and getting the scotch award of merit jo aakhri insaan kaam karta hai zameen ke upar he was feeling the the kind of rush kind of motivation and encouragement thanks a lot for thank you we are encouraged mr prem nath joint commissioner of police from delhi police operation cyber prahar against cyber frauds mr b l suresh deputy commissioner of police special police unit for women and children from delhi police project sashakti west bengal student credit card scheme from the department of higher education government of west bengal mr manish jain principal secretary mr shakil ahmed joint director of horticulture department of horticulture government of karnataka horticulture application for scheme implementation and regulating utilization of funds mr vivek chandel director Department of Technical Education Vocational and Industrial Training Government of Himachal Pradesh for internet lease lines and VC system for 70 government ITIs Mr Prasad Vithal Loyalkar Director Directorate of Higher Education Government of Goa Digital Integrated System for Holistic Teaching and Virtual Orientations Dr Abhay Wag Director Directorate of Technical Education government of maharashtra portal for post ssc diploma and post hsc diploma admissions thank you very much sir congratulations and i invite mr s j haider principal secretary higher and technical education and mr m nagarajan commissioner higher education education department government of gujarat for innovation haider uh, sir or the nagarajan sir kal hamare yahan vice president aane wale hain sir mm -hmm. ha join ho gaye ho gaye join Mr. Nagarajan. Yeah, thank you very much for having us here. And uh, as you know, Gujarat uh, has uh, uh, nominated a lot many of the projects, and uh, all of us are tied up with the uh, Honorable Vice President visit tomorrow. So I am very happy to be part of this, and my team is also here. Concerned officers who have been hands on with these projects will also be participating throughout this entire event, and uh, we are thankful to Scotch for having done the due diligence. and uh, yeah recognizing the ground breaking efforts that are being done uh, by various uh, uh, 
staff officers and the teachers and professors in the education higher education department and uh, i look forward to having a very uh, knowledgeable session where we will be able to see other winners also and uh, special thanks to coach for uh, uh, giving uh, going all the way out to engage with our team and uh, bring out the best projects thank you very much for having us here today well, congratulations mr nagarajan to mr heather as well as the entire team very well yes on behalf of uh, shri haider sir also i extend a warm gratitude to the coach team thank you uh, uh, mr nagarajan would you be joining for the panel discussion which is next after the inaugural i will try in fact i am on the on the move i will try to join from there sure we look forward to because such an encouraging work we would like this to be shared with our uh, other stakeholders sure thank you thank you and our officers will be there to uh, to you know be part of this event sure the next one also goes to you for project amrut love surgeon there is yet another one for mr, uh, mr. s j haider principal secretary higher and technical education and mr m nagarajan commissioner higher education for finishing school yeah. nagarajan if the concerned uh, yeah if the concerned uh, osd is there they can say word or two about the project mahesh bhai ji sir ji sir uh, thank you very much sir uh, uh, respected haider sir or respected nagarajan sir abhi kaam mein vyast hai to main unki जगह पर ये आप सबको शुभकामनाएं देता हूँ थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर स्कोच अवार्ड सबसे पहले तो पूरे भारत वर्ष में इस प्रकार की हमारी स्किल हो या तो सभी प्रकार की जो काम की आपने इस प्रकार नोंद ली है और हमारे जो बच्चे पढ़ रहे हैं उनको इनकरेज किया है इस प्रकार के अवार्ड से हमारे जो जो यूनिवर्सिटी है वो ज्यादा पल्लवित हो और पूरे गुजरात के और गुजरात के बाहर के स्टेट के भी साथ हमने जिस जिस से एम किया है जैसे कि सूरत कल कर्नाटक एन के साथ हमने फिनिशिंग स्कूल का एम किया है इसी प्रकार ये फिनिशिंग स्कूल को हम पूरे भारत वर्ष में ले जाने चाहते हैं अभी गुजरात में सत्तर से एक लाख बच्चे इनमें इनका लाभ लिया है और ज्यादातर बच्चों को उस प्लेसमेंट मिला है तो स्कोच अवार्ड प्राप्त करने के लिए ये पुनः हमने अगले साल उन्नीस में भी लिया था फिर से यह प्राप्त हुआ है इसके लिए हम आभार व्यक्त करते हैं और आप पूरी स्कोच टीम का पूरे हमारे एजुकेशन डिपार्टमेंट की वजह आभार और शुक्रगुजार करते हैं धन्यवाद नमस्कार बहुत बहुत शुभकामनाएं आपको जी सर फिर से आमंत्रित करता हूं श्री एस जे हैदर और श्री एम नागराजन फॉर गुजरात स्टेट इंस्टीट्यूशनल रेटिंग फ्रेमवर्क महेश जी बताएंगे इसके बारे में अभी हमारी एन के लिए कंपलसरी हो गया है कि सभी को एक्रेडिटेशन और रैंकिंग में आना है गुजरात स्टेट ने इसके लिए लीड ली है पूरे देश में और हमने हमारा खुद का ही रैंकिंग सिस्टम तैयार किया है अभी ये रैंकिंग से जो फॉर्मेशन है उसी को काफी स्टेट फॉलो कर रहे हैं काफी स्टेट से हमारे पास इंक्वायरी भी आ रही है की इस टाइप का एक नेटवर्क हमें भी फ्रेमवर्क हमें भी तैयार करके दीजिए हमारे स्टेट में इसके बाद लोगों का एन में जाना बढ़ गया है तो ऑब्वियसली हायर एजुकेशन का क्वालिटी और एक्सीलेंसी इसके साथ साथ इंक्रीज हो रहा है तो इसको प्रमोशन करने के लिए हम स्कोच के लिए स्कोच को प्रति आभार व्यक्त करते हैं आपकी वजह से सर काफी लोगों को पता चला है कि गुजरात में एक अच्छा इनिशिएटिव काम कर रहा है और ये नॉलेज कंसोर्टियम और एजुकेशन डिपार्टमेंट के अंदर में काम कर रहा है थैंक यू वेरी मच सर शुभकामनाएं ये भी डिपार्टमेंट को जाता है मुख्यमंत्री युवा स्वावलंबन योजना जी सर ये एक एक यूनिक सर प्रो ऐसे तो स्कॉलरशिप के लिए काफी प्लान्स और स्कीम्स पूरे देश में है लेकिन हमारे स्टेट में मुख्यमंत्री युवा स्वावलंबन योजना के अंतर्गत करीबन सभी स्टूडेंट को इसमें बेनिफिट दिया जाता है और नाइन्टी एप्लीकेशन को हम एक्सेप्ट करते हैं और उनको डायरेक्ट अकाउंट में उनका अमाउंट ट्रांसफर होता है कुछ प्रोजेक्ट में तो 25-25 लाख रुपया स्टूडेंट के अकाउंट में यहाँ से उसका फीस ट्रांसफर होता है तो ये हमारे सभी युवा स्टूडेंट्स के लिए बहुत ही बेनिफिशरी स्टूडेंट प्रोग्राम है अभी हमने जब कर्नाटक में थे तो इस प्रोग्राम के बारे में हमें काफ़ी लोगों ने इंक्वायरी की थी कि ये कैसे मैनेज किया जाता है क्योंकि वहाँ भी ये स्कोच अवार्ड की वजह से लोगों को जानकारी मिली थी कि गुजरात में ये एक स्कीम बहुत अच्छी तरह से चल रही है सबसे ज्यादा सक्सेस स्कीम है सर ये और बाकी स्टेट भी जो अभी यहाँ मुझे ऑब्जर्व कर रहे हैं वो इस प्रोजेक्ट को चेक करें देखें 
और अपने स्टेट में भी इसको इम्प्लीमेंटेशन करें ताकि हमारे एजुकेशन में काफी लोगों को बेनिफिट मिलेगा और थैंक यू फ्रेड स्कॉच किसको प्रमोशन के लिए सर सर इसमें एक और बात की पूर्ति भी करता हूँ महेश पटेल कि कल जो हमारे उपराष्ट्रपति जी हमारे गुजरात में आ रहे हैं और हमारा सौभाग्य है इसमें और ये जो एम के बच्चे हैं उनको सात लाख पाँच लाख चार लाख इस प्रकार की धनराशि के चेक उनके हाथों से प्राप्त होने वाले हैं वो हमारे लिए और पूरे भारत के लिए और गुजरात के बच्चों के लिए सौभाग्य की घड़ी तो इस प्रकार की सर ने बताया आपके सर सर ने इस प्रकार ये पूरी योजना बच्चों को मैक्सिमम 99.9 परसेंट सभी को मिलने वाली ये धनराशि वाली या तो सहाय वाली योजना धन्यवाद नमस्कार नमस्कार एंड कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन थैंक यू सर स्कीम फॉर डेवलपिंग हाई क्वालिटी रिसर्च कॉल शोध अगेन मिस्टर हैदर एंड मिस्टर नागराजन सर शोध के बारे में हम बताए तो गुजरात के बच्चों को आ, सभी फैकल्टी में आर्ट्स कॉमर्स साइंस बीबीए बायोटेक लो एनवायरनमेंट सभी प्रकार की जो स्ट्रीम्स है हमारी इनमें स्कीम ऑफ डेवलपिंग हाई क्वालिटी रिसर्च के लिए पूरे दो वर्ष में दो लाख रुपए दिए जाते हैं प्रति मास उनको रिसर्च करने के लिए पंद्रह हजार रुपये दिए जाते हैं और वो पूर्ति के लिए बीस और कुल मिला के दो साल में दो लाख रुपये बच्चों को दिया जाता है और इसी प्रकार अगली साल 9091 और इस साल भी करीबन 9031 इतने बच्चों को राज्य सरकार ने इस प्रकार की हाई क्वालिटी रिसर्च करने के लिए अच्छी तरह से उनको प्रोत्साहन दिया है इस प्रकार का सहाय की है स्कॉलरशिप की है और इसीलिए हमने उसका नाम ही शोध रखा है क्योंकि वैसे भी पी में संशोधन ही महत्वपूर्ण है और हमारी ट्वेंटी एनईपी ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी में भी संशोधन को ज्यादातर उनको महत्व दिया गया है तो इस प्रकार बच्चे तैयार हो और संशोधन करने वाले बच्चों को सभी प्रकार की सहाय और इक्विपमेंट भी प्राप्त हो जाए इसीलिए तब को इस प्रकार की सहाय सर राज्य सरकार से दी जाती धन्यवाद सर नमस्कार शुभकामनाएं फिर एक बार उद्यम ऑनलाइन लर्निंग फॉर एजुकेशन डिपार्टमेंट गवर्नमेंट ऑफ गुजरात मिस्टर हैदर एंड मिस्टर नागराज Yeah, thank you very much. Anyone from the Udayam team here? This is a very path-breaking initiative. Uh, during the COVID time, we were forced to go online, not just for teaching learning, but also for administrative activities. So we created a, a statewide platform where all educational stakeholders, including government, grant in aid, and private and government in universities and department, everyone come together and their operations are seam- seamlessly integrated. We are still building new modules and integrations for various schemes. but by and large all teachers have joined this program and uh, all the officers so we have single sign on and a single uh, platform for everyone to conduct various activities training and uh, various uh, schemes projects are also implemented through this this has improved transparency and uh, reduced the you know paperless uh, work and also uh, has increased and uh, online processing is happening and uh, system wide there is an improvement in productivity which is what is udayam online learning and uh, platform Thank you very much for recognizing this. Thank you very much. Opportunities through proficiency in English. Society for creation of opportunities through proficiency in English. Scope Education Department. Once again, Government of Gujarat. Mr. S. J. Hyder, who is also Chairperson Scope, and Mr. M. Nagarajan, who is the Chief Executive Officer. Anybody from Scope team, Mansi? I think okay. this is a. this is a scope is a very dedicated organization which is working to you know impart uh, english proficiency skills for uh, college students so that yes, they become sir. job ready are you there yes sir i am here sir now uh, please explain about scope in uh, one minute yes sir first of all uh, i am very much grateful to scope award and uh, i would like to convey my heart to thanks to honorable ps uh, higher and technical education head sir and m nagarajan sir Minister of Higher Education. I would like to extend my gratitude to the entire education department, and uh, this is an initiative, uh, brainchild of our honourable uh, Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi ji. Uh, when he was Chief Minister of Gujarat, he established Society for Creation of Opportunities for Proficiency in English in 2007, with the aim of ensuring that there is no lack of English proficiency among the youth of Gujarat. hence we are uh, promoting english we are strengthening the youth of gujarat where they can have all the four skills listening reading speaking and writing thank you sir congratulations project impact 
इंटीग्रेटेड मॉड्यूल ऑफ प्लेसमेंट अप्रेंटिसशिप कम ट्रेनिंग गुजरात नॉलेज सोसाइटी मिस्टर एस जे हैदर एंड मिस्टर जी टी पांड्या डायरेक्टर टेक्निकल एजुकेशन नेक्स्ट वन ऑल्सो गोज टू गुजरात नॉलेज सोसाइटी स्टूडेंट स्टार्टअप एंड इनोवेशन पॉलिसी शाह साहब आप रिकोगनाइज कर सकते हैं उनके बिहार पे हाँ हाँ सर ये भी एस एस आईपा का जो हमारा प्रोग्राम है सर है नागराजन सर शायद है उसमें या या सो दिस एस एस आई पी पॉलिसी स्टूडेंट स्टार्टअप एंड इनोवेशन हियर वी एम टू प्रमोट ऑन्टरप्रनरशिप कल्चर एंड ऑल्सो माइंड सेट इन दी यूथ वेन दे आर इन कॉलेज इट सेल्फ मेकिंग दैम अ जॉब क्रिएटर इन स्टेड ऑफ अ जॉब सीकर Uh, the biggest impact has been that in last 5 years more than 6000 ideas of students have been funded 800 patents have been filed and more than uh, 200 viable startups are there in the market and they are many of them are doing turnover in the crores so this policy has uh, you know enabled a innovation environment within the college and now it is being expanded to higher education uh, non technical institutions like art science and commerce students also so this is a very impactful uh, project for creating a future generation which is very entrepreneurial and this year uh, this time uh, the policy outlay has been increased uh, by five times from 100 crore to 500 crore and uh, it is one of the uh, very uh, for policy which is in focus and priority of government of gujarat congratulations knowledge consortium of gujarat geographic education mapping of higher education Mr S J Haider along with Mr R K Shah director knowledge consortium of Gujarat Mr Shah Shah and first uh, thank you for recognize the uh, this uh, portal for uh, uh, scotch award sir ye geographical mapping hamari sari institute ka geographical mapping kiya gaya hai aur uske sath sath uska total data uske sath attach kiya gaya hai एक यूनिक प्रोग्राम है जो प्ले ये ऑनलाइन प्लेटफॉर्म पे अवेलेबल है पब्लिक डोमेन में हमने रखा हुआ है और मैं आपका शुक्रिया करता हूं इसलिए कि इस प्रोग्राम को इस यहाँ पर स्कॉच पे हमने रखा इस प्लेटफॉर्म पे तो उस वजह से काफी स्टेट को इसका पता चला है तो आज इसके लिए जम्मू कश्मीर में प्रोसेस चालू है आज उत्तर प्रदेश से भी प्रिंसिपल सेक्रेटरी साहब का कॉन्टेक्ट किया था उन्होंने कि ये सेम चीज हमारे यहाँ भी करनी है तमिलनाडु में हम यहाँ से गाइडेंस कर रहे हैं कि किस तरह से इस पोर्टल को करेंगे पर आपके पोर्टल आपके प्लेटफॉर्म से हमारे बहुत सारे बच्चों को इसके जितने भी स्टेक होल्डर हैं पेरेंट्स हैं गवर्नमेंट डिपार्टमेंट्स हैं और बाकी स्टेट को बहुत बेनिफिट मिला है मैं आपको फिर से प्रणाम करता हूँ इसके लिए और इस अवार्ड के लिए आपने हमें पसंद किया उसके लिए थैंक यू करता हूँ बहुत बहुत शुभकामनाएं थैंक यू वेरी मच सर राष्ट्रीय उच्चतर शिक्षा अभियान Mr S J Haider along with Dr Yogesh Yadav state nodal officer Rusa a very good afternoon to all of you uh, first of all i am very thankful to scotch team uh, for providing this wonderful opportunity and uh, i am also very thankful to our honorable S J Haider sir principal secretary higher and technical education who is also state project director and i am also very much thankful for um, uh, m nagran sir Commissioner of Higher Education, who has provided a visionary part to implement this uh, Rashtra Uchchata Shiksha Abhiyan uh, among all the institutes. Basically, the Rashtra Uchchata Shiksha Abhiyan is providing the strategic funding for equity, access, and quality in the higher education. And we have utilized more than 464 uh, crore rupees for the benefits of the Gujarat state, uh, students of the Gujarat state. Under the visionary, uh, uh, under the vision of the our honourable Nagarjun sir and Aidar sir, thanks, thanks for uh, providing this opportunity and wish you all the best to all the participants and thank you very much for this thing. Congratulations. And now invite Mr. Mahesh Chandra Sharma, Managing Director, Rajasthan State Warehousing Corporation for warehousing. Uh, good afternoon, Dr. Guru Saranji and everyone present. First of all, uh, all I would like to thank the school team. For recognizing the initiatives and best practices of uh, RSWC, also where the profits have been uh, uh, in actual transfer to the society at large. Sir, uh, I would like to, uh, in brief, uh, describe about uh, the opening remarks and some issues which we were facing earlier. Uh, Rajasthan State Warehousing Corporation is a statutory corporation of government of Rajasthan. that was created under the warehouse corporation act 1962 of government of india 
and in last 60 years sir we were facing uh, major challenges uh, some of these were uh, redundant processes and uh, rising labor cost quality control and stress management so the challenges resulted in uh, high expenditure some tough operational management and shortage of trained manpower etc uh, after that sir nabard and nepcons uh, conducted a gap analysis uh, for nabard of available warehousing capacity in the state and the report concluded uh, that the state would require uh, ad, uh, some additional uh, warehousing capacity so the problems we were facing mainly were sir uh, the traditional style of warehousing construction which had limitation of its own uh, like uh, we were not able to create uh, uh, more than 2250 metric ton warehouse uh, at one place and the uh, self life of that warehouse itself was 25 to 30 years only uh, and the uh, some of the other problems were that uh, the warehousing operations were become challenging day by day because of the large number of employees and acute shortage of uh, professional manpower and of course the inefficient administration and uh, technical limitation of construction and low profits uh, by which uh, we were struggling so far so uh, for uh, then the turnaround for the turnaround the story uh, we uh, adopted some of the best practices we adopted some of the initiatives like uh, uh, rswc rajasthan warehouse corporation adopted a model for efficient trained and uh, professional workforce through ppp model uh, where uh, we introduced this ppp model with share in revenue with the private partners this unique model sir uh, in warehousing was conceived and all the managerial operations were outsourced keeping only supervisory controls with rajasthan state warehousing corporation uh, by posting one warehouse manager in each warehouse the rest of the manpower and the other uh, operations uh, are being conducted by the ppp partner and this model has been studied and adopted in various states of the country so far uh, the other pro, uh, uh, the uh, this model uh, where we outsourced and en- engaged the private organizations have also helped us in providing uh, value added services like wave reach community uh, commodity funding etc also then uh, in place of traditional brick and mortar structure we introduced uh, prefabricated steel structures and uh, the third one is that presently uh, all my 93 warehouse locations are geotagged and uh, they are fulfilling wdr standards so the outcome by taking these initiatives uh, are really good that uh, where the earlier capacity was 7.62 uh, lakh metric ton in rajasthan before 5 7 years now we are around 16 lakh metric ton as of now so we have created additional uh, storage capacity of course uh, crea- i mean catering the food security of the state then prefabricated steel structure which uh, we have now uh, used uh, has resulted in mag- op- optimum utilization of space with a self life of warehouse of around uh, 100 years or more than 100 years this was around 25 years earlier and uh, this geotagging uh, leads to easily finding the availability of st- uh, i mean the storage place and the new interventions have resulted in large revenues Uh, uh, which is also very evident that in the uh, last three years we have been constantly uh, earning the revenue of around more than 100 cr uh, that is profit before tax well it's been a great achievement mr sharma i must add and uh, i congratulate you as well as the entire team at uh, rswc for having achieved this feat congratulations once again mr ravindranath k sugu director and principal chief conservator of forests from gujarat ecological education and research foundation for development of climate resilient society for vulnerable communities of kutch district uh namaskar everybody due to some last minute meeting with minister sir uh, my director shri ak sugur sir could not be present in this uh, event uh, okay. on behalf of my director and gear foundation uh, i want to thank scotch for recognizing the efforts which we have made to develop a gujarat model for climate resilient society for natural resource development natural resource dependent community in kutch district as we all know kutch is climatically and seismically very vulnerable district and it is the one of the largest district in india 
uh, we have work to develop uh, climate we have work for them to enhance the adaptive capacity for this natural resource dependent community those are the most vulnerable community in the state and we have done almost 12 interventions uh, ecosystem based adaptations and community based adaptation and we have also gone for capacity building and knowledge management activities in that particular area i want to extend my gratitude to mof cc uh, ministry of environment and forestry and climate change as well as nabard and state climate change department for giving us this uh, work and to helping us to complete this work i want to thank uh, scotch once again for recognizing the efforts thank you so very much congratulations thank you dr sandeep kumar conservator of forest in rajkot gujarat forest department grassland of saurashtra a success story of junagadh circle good afternoon everyone uh, i am ayush verma uh, my immediate boss uh, mr sri sandeep kumar sir he could not attend it owing to some uh, inevitable uh, engagements but nonetheless he has acknowledged and uh, he is thankful uh, for uh, to scotch organization for recognizing the efforts just uh, uh, since i had been a part uh, of that uh, field team uh, in that project so uh, from my personal experience i should say that uh, so, uh, grasslands they are not just uh, they, they are not something which lies between the forest and the plains they are not a transition rather they are an ecosystem in themselves and they are the perfect habitats for the umbrella species which is there so once again uh, on behalf of uh, shri sandeep kumar sir uh, i thank the scotch organization for recognizing this effort. thank you very much well congratulations to all of you mr sanjay kumar sri vastava additional principal chief conservator of forests from gujarat forest department project karuna abhiyan well good afternoon everyone and uh, i thank scotch for recognizing uh, the effort by forest department karuna abhiyan is basically a 10 day program taken uh, around uttarakhand uh, that is uh, uh, 14th january and this uh, lots and lots of birds get injured through this abhiyan we basically uh, try to capture those uh, birds and try to treat them and then release them. i am uh, and uh, this year that is year 2022 we have been able to save more than 14000 birds with this with the, i also thank uh, scotch on behalf of all the volunteers doctors uh animal husbandry department the people and the police people they, who have helped us uh, in this and uh, if it uh, this program or is, if this karuna abhiyan uh, gets to the uh, final uh, this thing final uh, it gets finally awarded then it will be a tribute to the efforts of thousands and thousands of volunteers who have been working for this program for so many years without any thing uh, exp uh, without expecting anything in return so it will be nothing but a recognition for their efforts and in the last i again thank you uh, scotch for recognizing this this is a wonderful experience thank it's you it's a great initiative uh, you know thank nobody uh, actually pays any attention Ooh, yes, uh, yes. <laughs> and, uh, it's a great contribution that has been made by you under Karuna Abhiyan. Congratulations. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Mr. Ayush Verma, Deputy Conservator of Forest from Bhutan. Petroling plan for ghee, Gujarat Forest Department. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, thanks for the introduction. Uh, first and foremost, I heartily thank uh, the Scotch organization for exhibiting my project uh, titled Petroling Plan for Ghee. documented in the form of a book and uh, it is germane to mention that this is not a coffee table book neither is it a treasure trove on the tales of majestic lion rather it is a living real time under implementation plan of action which has laid i believe a solid edifice for effective petroling and vigilance in gear lands it lays down a blueprint to institutionalize petroling and an extensive map work along with real time tml files which are prepared for the entire gir national park uh, much of the gir century area and even the adjacent revenue it has been at length with systematic execution of petroling activities based on vital questions of what why when and how an activity should be performed 
So the key innovations include identification of the sensitive patches and spots in gear landscape buttressed by a vigorous field work that augurs best in anticipation and prevention of the human wildlife conflict. Then an elaborate mapping of existing patrolling infrastructure within forest and adjacent revenue land, along with demarcation of patrolling routes that vividly crisscross these sensitive patches was done. An emphasization, and importantly so, on the community outreach, their involvement and their sensitization was made, along with the collaboration with other departments like police, PGVCL and mines, etc. on for a fire cause that is to protect and serve forests and wildlife of care with umbrella species, Asiatic lion at the core. Finally, uh, I feel immensely satisfied that it is not merely an institutional memory. Rather, it is a ready recorder of tailor-made solutions curated for gift, which at the same time can be very well emulated in all the national park and wildlife centuries for protection, monitoring, patrolling and vigilance. In the end, I dedicate this project and the book that encapsulates uh, this project to the women and men in khakis. The women and men in khakis, that is my forest staff, veritable green avengers, who remain more often than not the unsung heroes committed to a higher cause, that is the cause of Mother Nature. Thank you very much for the patient listening. And thank you again, uh, this entire squash team for recognizing this effort. Congratulations once again. Thank you. Mr. Puneet Nair, Deputy Conservator of Forest from Surat, Gujarat Forest Department for Vizdalia model. Uh, uh, first of all, I would like to thank the Scotch team uh, for recognizing our this uh, ground initiative. So talking about Vizdalia, so Vizdalia, you know, has uh, been a, a great journey because, you know, we, uh, it's a unique model in which uh, we, used, we use the, you know, the power of convergence uh, to bring the change in the lives of uh, uh, tribal communities, forest dependent communities and I'm happy to share that uh, lives of more than 4,000 families have been impacted by this. Uh, you know, we have been carrying out, uh, you know, more than uh, 25 different kind of activities and uh, following, uh, you know, a satellite cluster model as well. And uh, talking about uh, its success, uh, so this model has already been recognized by the government of Gujarat and is uh, and started being replicated in four other uh, major districts uh, which are uh, which have the more uh, tribal dependent communities and uh, also the efforts have been recognized uh, by the government of india as well so uh, what we what we did was uh, that whatever the traditional uh, skill they were having we we, we just uh, you know help them and with the with the training and with the help of local resources uh, we made them self dependent we made them we uh, formed a co cooperative out of it and it's a totally community run initiative and with with the profit uh, profitability so uh, by that way uh, uh, this this uh, visalia model has been a success and a great journey so far i thanks once again uh, the scotch team for recognizing our efforts thank you so much congratulations ms bhargavi dave managing director gujarat livelihood promotion company limited for livelihood generation and marketing of rural products namaskar uh, i would like to thank scotch and not only me but uh, my team of uh, nearly 1000 people and more than more than uh, 12000 women they thank scotch for selecting us uh, for uh, for this award so it's a small step uh, in the world of the internet and in the world of the social media but it's a leap forward for the rural women so i used to tell when we launched our movie school on the moon, when journalists have asked him how do you feel? So he said, it's a small step for me, but it's a leap forward for human beings. So that is the same case here. So it's a journey, it has been started uh, in the last week of March and we, uh, still it is going on. Because uh, still we are making different kind of videos. We have posted nearly you know, uh, 1,100 videos. With, with, uh, they, with these videos, they are showing the product made by the women's self-help group. We call it Sakhimandan in Gujarat. So it has enhanced their confidence, not only their confidence, but uh, it has enhanced their uh, digital literacy also and their, uh, their presence on the uh, social media and their, uh, and their product sale also. So it's a really a big step for them and it's a community initiative, if I say. And it is totally an in-house product made by our own, own cluster coordinator as well as the women's central producer. So, we just uh, uh, 
like I can develop the self confidence of the women when my my when my women they say please like my channel share it and subscribe it then if uh, I also feel proud of them because they, in this world they are too small these are the rural women they are either staying in the uh, tribal area or maybe a hilly area or in a rural area where they don't have access to this kind of a they have not even thought of this so now and nowadays they are even uh, thinking uh, of having an online platform and their own store we are also uh, developing their online store also so it has boosted their confidence and uh, 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 it, in this journey they have learned how to do the online marketing and after covid uh, the customer is inclined for the online marketing so they have also get the benefit of all this uh, uh, that's that's, that's, that's really, that's really so, nice, uh, Galiji, because you know uh, uh, the kind of work that uh, GLTC has done over uh, the years, and particularly now when you have provided the value of generation by providing marketing uh, the forward linkages, market linkages in the rural products, and uh, that's a that's a great effort and a great contribution to uh, the women who do this. Sir, sir, you are not ready, sir. So that's a great contribution, as I said, you have made to uh, the livelihood generation as well as providing market linkages to these women who otherwise had no voice. So congratulations to you and the entire. Thanks a lot, sir. And I thank you on behalf of my all the women and they also say thanks to me. You know, I Thank you. Thank you. And now I invite Mr. Kalpesh with Lani, General Manager from Gujarat Maritime Board, Port Operation Management System. Sir, good afternoon, sir. Myself, Kiran Kaji, on behalf of Mr. Kalpesh Vitlani. I am uh, just due to some reason he was not attending today. Thanks to his first team to consider uh, a POMS as a, as a finalist. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Ms. Nuzat Gul, Secretary, Jammu and Kashmir Sports Council, My Youth, My Pride. Har din khel, har ek ke liye khel. Azadi ka Amrit Mahotsav. And it is an immense pleasure to be associated with the team of Scotch Awards and it was a great learning experience for all of us. Seeing the developmental work of other states and other panelists and other finalists, for me personally and my team, we had a lot of learning. This is My Youth, My Pride. This is a uh, program uh, designed uh, for involvement of youth from all the segments of the society, from rural, tribal, uh, underprivileged society children, so that they can participate in games. It's pertinent to mention uh, two years back, the participation level of the athletes was one lakh. Last year alone, the department has completed 17.5 lakh youth in different games. This year, target was set by Honorable Prime Minister Sir itself in the Pali, Samba, of Jammu. A lack of youth in different games, community programs, uh, national uh, games, national level competitions, and right now uh, will be a, a thrilling experience. Every uh, district has now indoor stadiums, cricket fields, pitches equipment is being given and people from all walks of life are encouraged to participate in the games because right now JNK government is ensuring that the sports becomes the community program. It, it should be seen as an alternative to drugs and other antisocial activities post COVID and post 370 situation in JNK. And Alhamdulillah, right now we have already crossed 70 lakh youth and by end of, gen by end of this uh, financial year, the target of 35 lakh youth participation in games and other community programs related to sports will be achieved. Once again, thanks for your patience and thanks for giving us a chance to be part of this. Thank you so much, sir. Congratulations. Maharashtra Forest Department, Mr. Narendra Gopinath Chandwar, Assistant Conservator of Forests for Wildlife Poaching and Smuggling, Raid and Seize Wildlife Parts. Sir, Sabi ko namaskar. I am Narendra Bhupna Chandewar, Assistant Conservator of Forest, Nagpur Division. I want to Scotch Group to thank them for bringing me to this platform and bringing our wildlife poaching and anti-smuggling program here. 
प्लेटफॉर्म देने के लिए थैंक यू सर ये जो इनिशिएटिव है एक्चुअली एक प्रोजेक्ट के जैसे ही हमने इसको इनिशिएटिव शुरू किया है और अभी हमारे जैसे 24 फोर रेड्स हो चुके हैं और उसमें से नियर अबाउट वन थर्टी इतने एक्यूज को हमने अभी अरेस्ट किया है और जिसका स्टेपिंग अप जो है इन्वायरमेंट एक्ट से और जो अपना वाइल्ड लाइफ एक्ट है उसकी तरह से तो इसलिए इसलिए मैं आ, हमारे जो फॉरेस्ट सेक्रेटरी रजिस्टर जो है पीसीसीएफ ऑफ वाइल्ड पी राव सर इसके बाद हमारे सी सी एफ नाइकरे सर और डी सी एफ हरा सर का मैं ये करता हूँ कि उन्होंने हमको इंक्रेज किया और स्काच ग्रुप को भी मैं यहाँ पर फिर से धन्यवाद दूंगा कि हमारी जो टीम है ये एंटी कोचिंग का और एंटी स्मगलिंग का जो हमने टीम बनाया है जो यहाँ पर वर्क कर रहा है और जिन्होंने एक अच्छा सा काम करके अभी तक जितना भी हमने स्मगलर्स को अरेस्ट किया है एक नेशनल लेवल तक हम इसको ले गए हैं तो यहाँ पर हम आप सभी का धन्यवाद कहते हैं थैंक यू थैंक यू मिस्टर आर सिंथिल कुमारन डेप्यूटी कंजर्वेटर ऑफ फॉरेस्ट मरीन नेशनल पार्क फॉरेस्ट डिपार्टमेंट government of gujarat for translocation and rehabilitation of true corals good afternoon one and all uh, i am representing uh, sri sri sandil kumaran uh, ifs uh, dc of marine national park jamnagar so i thank uh, the scouts for to acknowledge and recognize uh, our work on behalf of uh, the marine national park and uh, gujarat forest department this means a lot for us to implement such a new kind of uh, initiative for the conservation of the natural heritage of our nation as well as uh, being a role model uh, for the conservation of the whole india's natural heritage thank you so much congratulations you. congratulations thank once again the next thank one you. also goes to mr sentil kumaran for restoration of reefs using electricity yes i also thanks uh, thank thank you for the scouts for the same thank you so much thank you Ms. A. Sri Lakshmi, Conservator of Forest and Field Director, Paint Tiger Reserve, Climate Resilience Building and Livelihood Promotion through Development of Bioreserve Forest Areas on Degraded Forest Land. Hello everyone, Ms. Sri Lakshmi. First and foremost, I wish like to thank you, Scotch, uh, for recognizing our effort. Uh, this is a five-year project, which is in the middle of the project we are in. It is basically an eco restoration model where we are converting the concrete forest into natural forest. Very much suitable for the tigers. So this is first of its kind in the tiger reserves of the country, and it will be a role model wherein uh, nearly 40 hectares of uh, meadows are being developed in the 272 hectares of Bikaner area, along with the livelihood uh, mm -hmm. of the people. And this will be a role model for wherever the relocation of the villages will be going to take place in the tiger reserves, and which can be converted into a habitat. Uh, basically a uh, good eco restoration restoration model uh, and i would like to uh, put on note of thanks to uh, shri venugopal reddy sir our secretary sir and all the seniors who supported us and mr ravikaran govikar my predecessor who did this work and my ground staff and my team uh, mr atul devkar mr shukla and my mr uh, kate and the project coordinator mr vasis ji and almost and again our funding agency nabard for giving us such an important objective and work to do Thank you, one and all. Thanks for recognizing this work, and this is one of its kind in the country. And I wish uh, that we we'll reach to that other level also. Thank you, Scotch Ever Scotch Group, for recognizing our work. Thank you, thank you so much. Congratulations, Dr. Virendra Sharma, State for Project Director, Samagra Shiksha, Government of Himachal Pradesh for E Sambar. Hello, uh, am I uh, am I audible, sir? Yes, you are. Okay, uh, we uh, on the behalf of Samagra Shiksha. uh we thank you, uh, thank the scotch team for this recognition and e sambad in itself has been sort of a remarkable product in um uh, improving the education delivery for the state and we hope to keep working towards it in the coming future as well thank you sir congratulations the next one all also goes to samagra shiksha government of himachal pradesh digital sathi dr sharma uh again uh thank thanking the scotch team for this recognition sir and so digital sathi in itself was one of the first initiative in the country where basically the government department launched a voluntary phone donation campaign to improve or solve for the problem for digital access to a lot of children in the state during the pandemic period and provide them access to online education and i 
hope that this example through your platform would be sort of an replic uh, platform for replication for other states as well going forward so thank you for the recognition sir congratulations once again utsa shri school education department government of west bengal mr debasi sarkar joint director uh, good afternoon sir uh, 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 you say uh, thank you, sir. Uh, we thank uh, very much uh, this uh, Scotch Group for giving us this uh, uh, recognition. Uh, so basically, this uh, UCC uh, it has been initiated as a part of the uh, e-governance initiative of the state government. Uh, this is basically our HRMS uh, database of uh, you know, all the teaching and non-teaching staff of uh, uh, schools uh, under the school education department. And uh, okay, what? We the have uh, provided uh, the facilities for uh, t- transfer of t- uh, employees through this portal, and uh, uh, as you know, this is uh, uh, completely free of human intervention, and uh, it is based on some logic and the algorithms. And uh, you, uh, till now, it has been uh, launched uh, in, in, uh, in uh, just last year, and uh, during this one year, uh, we have affected. Uh, more than thirty thousand uh, transfer of uh, teaching and non-teaching employees uh, through this portal, uh, and uh, so uh, we uh, look forward to uh, b- bring this Uchhosri portal to the next level. And uh, uh, once again, uh, we uh, thank uh, Scotch Group for uh, recognizing uh, our this effort, and uh, uh, we uh, look forward to be part of this Scotch Group in future also. Thank you, sir. Congratulations, Mr. Vivek Kumar, Additional Secretary, Department of Forests, Government of West Bengal, Joint Forest Management of People's Movement. So, my sincere thanks to entire Scotch team and congratulations to all the shortlisted projects. So, this brings us to the uh, end of the announcement of the first round of Scotch Order of Merit. <laughs>